All right, I'm back, and we're gonna continue on our way. Let's get to that warp gate. Because once we get to the warp gate, we can warp to the mystery machine and see what we're gonna do from there. No, we're not doing this again. Not, not yet. We'll come back and do this. Because like I said, I want to get all the Scooby Snacks in the game. But not yet. Alright. So we got to work our way back. All the way. To here. There we go. The Mystery Machine Part 1. Let's see what we have to do here. So we can't go back into the mansion yet. So it's either the hedge maze or the the sea town. I think we're gonna go to the sea town because if you remember, there was that tar on the ground and we couldn't get to uh, that one door, but now we can. So let's go to Smuggler's Go, the fishing village. Knock on the dock part one. Now we could have used the warp gate to warp where we need to be, but I'm just gonna go get some Scooby Snacks now that I have the double jump. You again, eh? Well, this is the fishing village. Be careful not to fall in the water. No! You Scooby Snacks everywhere. Someone better clean up this mess. Huh? It's the real Don Knotts' voice. Now that we have the helmet, we can break these containers and get the Scooby Snacks within. Right. And stomp on these damn crabs. Ow, no! Get out of here, crab. You're related to Mr. Krabs, cheapskate. Yeah, you can jump on top of that crate and get up here for more Scooby Snacks. Da -na -na -na. I wonder, I can't tell if this music is better or if Scoop, uh, Spongebob's music is better. They both have very good music. Do, 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 do. I think I like Spongebob's music better. It's so good. And then you can't press this button yet because you need another ability. <gasps> but just jump on this and swing across and then avoid these flying fish because they hurt a lot get out of here rat double jump for scooby snacks groovy snacks how about that stop on your head and then we can finally kill this caveman. Get out of here. Ow, no. Ouch, he's hitting me. Get out of here. Roots the caveman. Yes, it is. Yeah. Hit him so hard in the head. Ah, oh, crap. Get up there, Scoob. Get up. Alright. Now, I believe we can get on top of... I don't know if we've already done this, so we're gonna do it again. Ah, oh, crap. Back here. I need you. Fine, I'll come back for you later. Shock on the dock, part two. Part two! Alright. We can finally get these Scooby Snacks, because I can double jump for them. Yes! Scooby! Rahoob! Ah, no hooks! No, the hooks I'll never go, I swear. I won't go near them. Got this, and jump! Yeah, look at his question mark. He didn't know where I was. He's too dumb. He's a Neanderthal. Even though Neanderthals were pretty smart. Ow, oh, no, I died. The hook got me. That's why you don't play on the hooks. Because they hook you. They kill
kick you in the face and hook you to death. Uh, boom, and skadoo. Now, you can actually get back here. So if you see it next to this house, you can get back here. And there are more Scooby Snacks. But you can't get these Scooby Snacks without the uh, invention that we just got. The Gloshes. So that's pretty cool. Dun, 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 dun. Get over here. Yeah. Take a nap. I don't know if we could get over here. I don't think we can. Actually, I think we might be able to jump on this fish. Nope, we can't. Dang it. So we can't get over there yet. But eventually, I think we'll be able to. No. No, not the hooks. Not the hooks. Not again. Alright, so, originally we went this way, if you remember. Actually, no, we can't. This button appears to be stuck. Come back after you find an invention that will let you bash it. This is the same kind of thing. We need an invention to press that button. But, we can smash these two things now. And here we go. We can, move, we can finally move on to Fishy Clues for Scooby-Doo Part 1. This is my least favorite area. Because it's four parts long and it takes forever to collect all these Scooby Snacks. Look at that, we're already 35% done with this game. It's not bad. We're only on like part seven or eight of the walkthrough. Alright, so let's come down here and just collect away. Now, ah, these things pop out of nowhere. Ah! No, it's too slippery. Ah, it's slippery. Damn slippy. Ah! Hit her. Hit her in the face. Hit her while she's down. Ah, oh, we can't press the button yet. No. Oh, another one! Get out of here! No! Don't need a fan club right now. Stay away. She's more annoying than, uh, scary. Oh, another one! Get away from me! I'm just gonna leave them alone. I'm not even gonna hit them, because they're not worth my time. Oh, crap. I was never here. It wasn't me. That was my evil twin. Yes. Collect Scooby Snacks, Scooby. Uh, uh, uh. I told you. Ah, oh, damn it. I told you it's hard as crap. Stupid conveyor belts. They're in all four parts of this area. Jump up. Uh, uh. Yes. Get on there. Come on, Scooby. Yes! Uh, get the Scooby Snacks! Yeah! No, avoid these flying fish, they're everywhere! Ah, no! I did exact. I. Ow! No! Ow! I thought you could step on their head, but I guess you can't! Uh, two more! Get him, Scooby! Yes! Ow! No! I dropped down! Oh. Uh, more of them! Stay away! 
Stay away, you piece of crap! They pop out of nowhere and- Ow, you piece of shit! Go fuck off! Scooby Snacks. Ah, another one! No! Get away! I don't need a fan club. Stay away from me. Stupid floor is so slippery. Ah, damn it! you these rooms are annoying. It's not like Spongebob where you get checkpoints. And these things are the most annoying monsters. Damn it! They're the most annoying monsters in the whole game. Because they don't leave you alone. They're the fan club. Ah, just hurry on out of here. Yes. We made it out. No, we didn't. Damn it. Get onto the trampoline, Scooby. Hurry. No, what the heck? You stupid flying fish. Come on. Get us out, Scooby. Yes. Alright, watch the next part and we'll continue. I know this was a long part.